This is the story of a stickman who is hiding from the world with his family. But one day, luck separates him from his family, and he has to face many dangers one after the other. So let's see if he can come back to his family. But before that, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. So the story starts in a small coastal town, which is completely covered with snow. And this is the house of Stickman on a hill, where he lives with his wife and three children. Today is Christmas Day, and Stickman wants to surprise his children. He tells them that Santa has brought presents for them, and all three children are very happy to hear this. Then they check their gifts, where Stickman has made some toys for them, like a car and a drawing pen, and he teaches the children to use them one by one. In the evening, they come out to play in the snow, and then a human girl comes there. Stickman and his family immediately make themselves lifeless so that they can hide their secret from humans, and as soon as she leaves, they start having fun again. In the same way, they were spending their days well, and Stickman was also very happy to have such a lovely family. Then soon the spring season begins, and greenery spreads all around. Leaves were also growing on their body, and in this amazing weather, he goes out jogging alone. Here he meets a snail, who was struggling to reach her food, and Stickman helps her in this. But he didn't see that a puppy is hiding in the bushes, and before the snail warns, the puppy suddenly comes in front of him. The puppy is very excited to see a walking stick and thinks that this is perfect for him to play with. Stickman runs and tries to go home, but the puppy doesn't let him. And after a while, he finally catches him. Then he takes him to his master, who tells him to throw the stick away and fetch it from the puppy. Stickman tells the puppy that he is also a living creature like him and wants to return to his family. He thinks that the city puppy has understood him, but the puppy catches him again. His master thinks of throwing the stickman again, but then a guard stops him and says that you can't keep your dog open like this. The boy takes his dog away from there and guard puts stickman aside. Stickman thinks that this is the right opportunity and he should go back to his house immediately. But a girl suddenly comes in front of him. That girl was also looking for a stick for herself so that she could use it in a game, and she picks it up and takes it with her. There the stick lady waits for him at breakfast, she thinks that he will come back in a while. We see that girl again, who throws the stickman into a river to race. And the stickman also swims peacefully and comes out. Then at one point, he tries to come out of the river, but because of the flow of water, he is unable to do this. And falling from a water wheel, he reaches a river. He sees that his house is getting away from him, and then he sees a fishing line. There is a fish stuck in a hook. He also tries to come up with his help and frees the fish on the way up. Then he sees a frog, who helps him get out of the fishing rod. The frog sees that the stick man is going straight toward the swan. But before he could warn him, swan catches him and takes him with her, and sets him in its nest. The stick man tries very hard to get out of there, but the swan does not let him get out of there. On the other hand, his family goes out to find him, but the stick man is nowhere to be seen and then they comes back to their house. Swan lays eggs which soon give birth to some babies. And seeing their family, the stickman also starts missing his family. Then the swan takes his children away from there, and somehow the stickman frees himself. But the troubles still do not leave him, and he bumps into a boat pedal and falls into the river again. The river flows it and takes him with it, and we see that he has now arrived at a sea. His eyes open when a bird comes, and he sees that he is getting away from his town. He thinks about swimming in fear, but it was very difficult to compete with the waves, and then a big wave takes him underwater. There the stick lady tries to find him and comes to the nest, where a leaf of the stickman had fallen, and then she sees the frog in front of her. The frog tells her that the stickman has gone into the flowing sea, and the stick lady gets worried to hear this. Here the stickman reaches a flowing beach, and sees that there are people roaming everywhere. Then he sees a lighthouse far away, just like it was in his town, and he thinks that he has come back to his town. He runs towards the lighthouse and hides behind a sand castle to avoid humans. There a man makes it a flagpole and puts it on the castle, which makes the stickman very angry. He was mad and think why people do not leave him alone. Suddenly a girl sees him, who makes him a sword to play. And like this, someone uses it as a bag, some as a drawing pen, some as a bow, and some as a bat. We see changing seasons. 
It is known that the stickman has been struggling for a long time, and then a boy makes him a boomerang and throws him far away, and this time the stickman falls into a snow pile. There a boy picks him up and puts him in his snowman. He somehow gets himself out of there and thinks that Christmas will come soon, and he wants to spend it with his family. In this hope, he starts moving forward, and then he sees that his house is visible in front of him. Seeing this, he is very happy. Finally, he has come back to his family, but after going there, he finds out that this is some other place. This breaks his heart, and the other hand stick lady was also losing hope. Because of the cold, start freezing, and he loses hope to go back to his house, and he can't even see that he has come out of the jungle and reached a town. Here too a girl picks him up and brings him to her house, so that she can use him to set fire with it. And the helpless stickman doesn't know anything about it, he was just thinking about his wife and children. And thinking this, suddenly his eyes open. Seeing himself in a fireplace, he gets scared, and then he hears someone coming from the chimney. He sees that something is moving up there, and he thinks of running out of there in fear. Then that voice asks for help, that I am trapped up here, and the stickman also gets ready for this. He goes into the chimney and starts pulling it down, and sees that there is a person trapped in it. Then finally he brings him out, and finds out that this is Santa. Santa says I know that you are the stickman, and thanks him for his help. Santa places a gift in the house and was about to leave, but then he thinks of the stickman, who is looking a little sad, and Santa says that maybe you should come with me. The stickman also happily follows him, and they both start flying on Santa's sleigh. He starts helping Santa in distributing the gifts, where he first finds the boy who had used him like a bat. And seeing this, the stickman gives him a bat. In the same way, he also delivers gifts to the other children, and sees that Santa now only has three gifts left. Then Santa tells him that this gift is for some special children, and tells the stickman to look in front. The stickman sees that he has returned to his town. On the other hand, we see his family, who is missing the stickman a lot on Christmas, and they wish to be with stickman on Christmas. Then they hear a noise, and they think that this is perhaps a big bird, who is attacking their treehouse. They go inside and check, and see that the stickman is standing there, who also has the gift given by Santa. They are very happy to meet each other again, and the stickman promises that now he will never leave them. Then we see Santa, who wishes Christmas to the stickman and his family. And with this, the video ends. Hope you guys like the video, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.